The American rabbit is a breed of rabbit that may be medium to large in size and usually has a semi-arch or mandolin shape. It is a breed recognized by the American Rabbit Breeders Association or ARBA in 1917. According to the association standards, the American rabbit has to have a mandolin body shape and a coat that has the best quality to be used as a coat. The American rabbit is also popular for being a sweet, calm, laid-back, and docile pet. This makes it a good pet for families, seniors, singles, and older children. The semi-arch shape of the American rabbit is known for being the best body shape when viewed from the side. The body does not rise from behind the ears but curves and flattens upward towards the midsection. The ears are narrow and proportional in length. These large rabbits can weigh up to 11 pounds when they are fully grown. The coat is very attractive and soft. It is silky to touch and feel. Both kinds of American rabbits have very short fur with a slight flyback. This means that the coat will always go back to its previous place after you move your hands or pet it backward. Breed Color The American rabbit was accepted in the Arba as a blue rabbit because this breed was classified as having the deepest and the darkest fur of gray or blue rabbits. The Arba further said that the color is best as uniform rich, dark slate blue with no white hairs and has a sandy or rust color. In 1925, a white American rabbit emerged and was immediately recognized. It was created by selecting white sports or mutants and adding a white, red-eyed albino Flemish giant breed. This is an albino type of rabbit or the red-eyed white while the blue-eyed whites have already appeared. The latter was considered as sports in the American rabbit breed and cannot be used for the show. Aside from these colors, the American rabbit also comes in black, but this is not a color recognized by the Arba. Breed Shape The standard shape for the American rabbit breed is a mandolin or a semi-arched shape with a long loin compared to the common, commercial round shape like the New Zealand and Californian. When in the show, the mandolin shape has a different posing than commercial form breeds. To best display the shape and the length of the body as well as the modified point of the highest arch above the hips, breed-specific posing is used. American rabbits are known as normal shaped compared to dwarf breeds. Its medium size means that an adult American rabbit can weigh from 9 to 12 pounds. Females are slightly heavier and larger than males. History of the breed The blue American rabbit breed was created in Pasadena, California. This was developed by Lewis H. Salisbury in 1917. Experts say that the American rabbit was the first species developed in the country, However, another breed called the New Zealand Red conquered the United States several years before. Compared to other breeds who reveal the lineage of the specimen, Salisbury did not reveal the breeds that he chose to come up with the American rabbit. The shape of the rabbit's body suggests that it may be from the Flemish giants, Beveren, Vienna, and the Imperial. If this was so replicating, this breed might be impossible because the Imperial rabbit breed is already extinct. It was in 1925 when the white variety American rabbit was officially accepted by the Arba. The name was originally called the German Blue Vienna but was later renamed before World War I to the American Blue Rabbit. Quite recently, rabbit keepers and rescue groups who were unfamiliar with the appearance and the features of the breed, the American Rabbit was called Mutt Rabbits or the American. And because of this, confusion regarding the actual status of the breed happened. The American Rabbit was also known as a rare breed. It was popular until the 1950s for its meat and fur. Until 1949, the blue and the white breeds were included in the top five or six popular and were known as the ideal rabbits for commercial use. After the development of other commercial breeds like the New Zealand and the Californian, and the end of the domestic clamor for fur, people lost interest in the American rabbit. And following a contraction in the population of the breed in the 1980s, the breed is now considered rare in North America. These are also hunted down due to their sharp teeth. In 2005 as different rabbit breeds were included in the American Livestock Breed Conservancy's Conservancy Priority List, the American rabbit was classified as rare and critically endangered. The white American was also in danger of being dropped from the Arba list in 2004 because of a lack of representation during the yearly Arba event. Afterward, the American rabbit population has dramatically increased. In 2012, the ALBC changed the classification of the American rabbit from being critical to a less endangered or threatened category. One of the reasons why the breed revived was the dedication of breeders to ship breeding rabbits across the country. Also, a line of the white American was also recently discovered in Alberta, Canada ends a community of Hutterites. Finally, the American rabbit is slowly being regarded for its meat. The breed is included in the Ark of Taste, Meat, and Poultry Slow Food USA project. This project has led to an increased interest in the breed as a homestead or heritage breed. Reproduction the American rabbit is known for its lovely coat, easy demeanor, and prolific breeding. 
because of their short gestation period of only 30 days, the rabbit can breed many times a year. It can produce around 5 babies per gestation period and will be ready to mate in just a few weeks after. Rabbits become sexually mature in just a few months after birth. Mating is quick, but courting can be longer. Bucks chase after does until it submits. This can take anywhere from a few minutes to a few days. Females may signal that she is interested in the male by the changes in the color of her private areas. Once the female is pregnant, she will lose interest in the male and will soon eat slowly. She will need a place to lay her babies, and the perfect place is a burrow in the wild, but for domesticated rabbits, a bed of hay or straw would suffice. She will diligently arrange the bed with straw and even use fur to make the bed soft and warm. She will stay in the nest as she delivers her babies. The baby American rabbits are born blind, naked, and very small. The mother will stay a few days in the nest to care for her young, and these will greatly grow in size and will change in appearance. The mother will soon leave the nest and will only return nightly to a nurse for a very short period. Personality and Behavior American rabbits were mostly bred for their meat and fur and less used as a pet. But lately, families and many seniors and singles prefer the American rabbit to other breeds because of its calm and docile temperament. But the behavior of this breed may depend on where it was raised. If it is used to being with humans, then expect it to be easygoing, easy to train, and maybe house-proofed. If the rabbit was raised without human interaction and just near its littermates, then it can be skittish and nervous all the time. But with constant interaction and the use of treats and food, it can soon outgrow this behavior and become docile and calm towards its owners. Some American rabbits are nervous around people, especially those with small hands, and to people who don't know how to hold or approach them. This is why it's not a good breed for families with very young children. The American rabbit may suddenly become scared and defend itself by biting the person's hand. Young American rabbits are very energetic and will hop about, play games with their littermates, and will eat a lot. But adults seem to be very laid back and will just be contented chewing on hay inside their enclosures. Dental care. An important part of a rabbit's health is caring for its teeth. An American rabbit is known for growing teeth, and sometimes these can grow very fast. As an owner, you must make sure that the rabbit's teeth don't overgrow. Rabbits usually chew so much because if they don't, their teeth will grow very long. When this happens, their teeth can grow into their mouths and jaws, which will cause terrible pain and will also affect the way they eat. You can help your rabbit by offering hay as it files down the rabbit's teeth naturally as they chew. Use pieces of wood, wooden baskets, or other cage accessories that can help fill the rabbit's teeth. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.